Now let's talk about the calculation of resistance in a series circuit. To calculate the total resistance in a series circuit, which means resistors in a line, the total resistance is a sum of the individual resistances connected in series. Quite simply, the total resistance R is equal to R1 plus R2 plus R3 plus any other resistor that is along the same line that are in series. So if I were to ask you, what is the total resistance of these two that are in series? The total resistance would be R1, 2 ohms, plus R2, also 2 ohms, equals to 2 plus 2, giving you a total of 4 ohms of resistance. Now, let's take a look at resistance in a parallel circuit. Total resistance in a parallel circuit is 1 over R, total resistance, is equals to 1 over R1 plus 1 over R2 plus 1 over R3 plus 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 plus. So, please pause the video here and you can try to solve this question. What is the total resistance? Okay, now let's do the answer. 1 over R total is equals to 1 over R1 plus 1 over R2. This will be equals to 1 over 2 plus 1 over 4. And this gives us 0 0.75. Now, a lot of people mistakenly stop here and think that the total resistance is 0 0.75 ohms. However, you have not solved the question yet because 1 over R total is equals to 0 0.75 ohms. So, R total will be equals to 1 divided by 0 0.75 and the total resistance of these two is equals to 1.33 ohms. Now, this is interesting because it shows that if you put the two resistors in parallel, the total resistance of this becomes less than the smallest resistor in the parallel circuit. However, if you look at the series circuit, you would see that the total resistance in the series circuit would be more 